90% of African men think their children are their only responsibility mm. in terms of finance and not their wives. How can women make them understand that they need to be loved also? There's Christian culture. A Christian must let the kingdom culture override his culture. And the Christian culture is that you provide for your household. Anything outside of that is disobedience to the word of God. A bringing perspective. My dad died when I was 11, so I didn't see much of my dad. Between when I was 5 and when he died, at least I saw him, so I saw the way he did. He was very domesticated, so it's natural for me to be domesticated. And secondly, because my dad died early, my mom was a traveling businesswoman, so I lived on my own, doing home chores, cooking and all of that, just come naturally with me. So some men have a wrong upbringing of not being helpful at home. Some women have a wrong upbringing. Their mom was the boss in their house. So those upbringing will come to play. But when you are born again, you must let your Christian life override the upbringing that caused this kind of problem. You see, marriage is evolving. And that's just the reality. The kind of marriage my dad and my mom had is not the kind of marriage me and Titi had. In fact, there are some of us, if our family in Africa see what we do at home, they would think they've given you some juju. Yeah. Marriage has evolved. But when you have married somebody is late, it's your cross. You bear it. I'm sorry to say so. He said, every man will carry his cross. I'm carrying my own cross, which is Titi that I marry. <laughs> listen, li- li- listen. But she's carrying her own cross too, which is me she married. Yes. You understand what I'm saying now? We are each other's cross. Yes. A man should actually look after his wife. It's your pride. It's your glory. Admonish you men in this church. Look after your wife. And those of you women that your mouth are sharp, you want to be your husband's boss. Go and humble yourself. A Christian wife must submit. Men, don't use money as weapon of warfare in the house, please. It's your responsibility to look after both your wife and your children. And listen, if you don't look after your wife, your children will hate you at the end of the day.